Okay, as everybody knows that there's this petition going on online saying that this woman wants to make a PG-13 Deadpool movie, wants the studio to make a PG-13 Deadpool movie. Now, I don't want to seem like I'm beating a dead horse to death right now, but I feel like this is something I need to talk about, and everything aside from the page that we do, because it's an issue, and this is, this is an issue that I have with it. Number one, your kid who is four or five years old, or maybe six, I don't know how old the kid may be, but does not need to go and see this movie. It's rated off for a reason. It's for adults. Later on in life, when it gets older, he can go ahead and watch this movie. But right now, no. Um, another thing is, too, you doing, people doing a petitions online and everything is not going to work. Movie studios do not care about what you think. All they care about is... Can this movie make me money in the movie theaters, or is this going to shut the cash register drawers in the movie theater? And right now, and everything, it has a good fan base. The commercial advertisings are doing great with it, and therefore, you know, I don't. They're not going to change it. And not only that, but if you think about it, if they make a PG-13 Deadpool, and then they put that aside from the red R version, they have to bump something from the from another movie. To fit in for that Deadpool movie. So therefore, that studio who made a new movie is not going to make that much or not make much at all. And therefore, you know, you're going to, that studio is going to lose money. Now, I believe that they could actually do this other thing where you can make an, um, an unrated version for the Blu-ray or whatever and also have a PG-13 version of it. And do it that way. And that might be the best way to go about it. But making a PG-13 movie and everything. You're watering down what the character is. You're also sensing what the character is. Without even understanding fully what this character is at all. Because you probably don't even read comics at all. Because he's the merc with the mouth. He's the one who does not know how to shut up. And, even, and there's even a parental advisory sticker on one of the comics. And everything. Which is Deadpool versus the Marvel world. And to me, that was a great comic, but it's rated R for a reason, and that reason alone is the, is why it's not for kids. And I'm, hey, if your kid wants to see it and everything, don't let them go see it. You're the parent. They're the you're the parent, and they're the adult. Like you're the adult. I mean, you're the adult. They're the kid. You're supposed to not abide by what the kid wants to do. You're the parent. Step up. Be a parent. But, I also want to address the fact, too, is that after everything's all said and done, the studio is not going to listen to the person at all. And the fact that this petition's going around, and it doesn't matter if you have, like, a million um, petitions going around, the studios are not going to la look at it. They're going to laugh at it, and then they're going to throw it away in the garbage can because they don't care. And I feel like in my heart, though, that everything's going to be fine and everything else. Not even to worry about this whole entire thing because it's not going to happen. And it's just something that I felt like I needed to address a little bit more. Because of the fact that I like giving a little bit more insight into how certain things work. As opposed to having two different, uh, having two different movie versions of the same movie. And how that could actually affect other movies from making more money for that studio so therefore that's why i wanted to make this video um but anyways jump up in the comments tell me what you guys think do you think that this movie should be pg-13 do you think this movie shouldn't be pg-13 or should you keep the rated r version or do you think that you need to have two different versions at the same time it doesn't matter what i think or what i say it matters what you guys think because i like to hear what you guys have to say anyways don't forget to hit the subscribe button at the bottom and don't forget to like the video and I hope everyone has a great night, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.